What's up guys, doing some shooting again today with the Ruger Mini 14. This is again in another uh, Chote machine and tool stock. This one is known as their side folder. Making the Ruger Mini 14 a very compact little package. Uh, very nice little simple push button. Deploys the stock out and when you have it folded up, you eliminate 12 inches off of your overall uh, length of your rifle here. Uh, very, very positive lock. There is no, mo no movement at all right there and what you're hearing is the spring of the empty magazine in there. But uh, no, no rattle or anything like that. And when it's deployed, no movement at all. Very nice little compact package. Uh, nice little positive locking uh, device on the back there. Um, as far as how lightweight it is, it puts on just a little, a little more weight than their standard conventional stocks, but no more than what the actual Ruger Mini 14 stock weighs, uh, even with all this uh, metal right here on the back. Uh, makes the, the balance of the rifle right here in the middle when it's folded. And of course, when it's unfolded, it's still roughly in the middle, but you can feel just a little more, a little more tail heavy, but not much at all. So a very balanced when you, whenever you're packing it up and handling it. And nice thing about this one is, is you can still shoot with the, uh, the stock folded if you're into that sort of thing or if you need to. Not bad, not bad at all. Uh, it makes climbing in and out of a vehicle with something like this very easy to do. Throwing it over your shoulder makes it a very compact little package. As you can see here, doesn't take much at all as far as uh, how much room you have on your back. I can see somebody easily being able to uh, strap this to the side of a pack, onto a backpack, and uh, or possibly throwing it into a backpack. Now, if you have typical standard backpacks, you might have a little bit of the barrel sticking out but uh, not much at all, and this is, a, this is about as close as you can get to. Uh, if you knew the older uh, Ruger Mini 14s that had that wood folding stock on it, uh, this is about as close as you can get without, uh, without buying one of those. Uh, and those are <laughs> just about as much as the gun costs. Uh, this one's very affordable, you can check their website, I've got a link in the description box below. But uh, just gonna be doing some shooting today and just kinda hanging out with it and feeling it out. So far, it feels great. Even, uh, even shooting it just without the stock, you can still, you know, with my red dot on there, have no problem with it. Um, up front here, if you're just wondering, I have a UTG 45 degree offset for a mount with a light. Again, making this a pack rifle. I'm gonna have a nice little light on there. Got a red dot on there. And uh, got, of course, the backup iron sights on it. But a really, a really nice little, you know, again, compact package. This is Ace 2 Tactical Paracord Slings. Links in the, in the bottom down below in the description box with a coupon code, if you're curious. A lot of, a lot of guys always ask me, hey, man, where'd you get that sling? It's always in the link down below. Especially, it's with the uh, d uh, discount code as well. You can see up here, as far as mounting the sling goes, which is why I brought that up, there is a swivel sling stud right here on the top of this. And then of course you go with uh, your, now mine is modified, but uh, if you had a uh, Ruger, standard Ruger Mini 14 ring up here, uh, you can mount your sling the rest of the way to that. If not, if you wanna do what I did, is uh, I ground down the sides where the ring used to be so that I can fit a standard uh, swivel sling stud there. Or not a stud, but a run a standard swivel sling. Um, again, nice little package here. Not, not heavy at all, especially with all the junk I got on it. You see on the back here, it has a nice little recoil pad on the back. It's kind of nice of them to do that instead of leaving this plastic or something. But a uh, very nice squishy little recoil pad. Seems durable too, so it doesn't look like it's anything that's gonna fall apart. Um, I, these stocks have actually been around for a while and there's a lot of guys that swear by them. Um, I've known guys that have had these types of stocks by Choate with the folders on them that even after years of handling, uh, nothing really ever gets loose in here. And you can hear, again, no play at all, no rattle or anything. Um, Choate's been ha Choate has a pretty good uh, reputation in the industry as far as making good quality stocks go at an affordable price. All right, guys, that's all I got for you for right now. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to hit the like button down below. I want to thank Choke Machine and Tool for sending this stock out to show you guys. Again, it's a very nice little stock. We'll have a uh, link down there where to find it. Um, can't go wrong with a nice little side folder if you're looking for a way to make your Mini 14 a little more compact, a little more packable. Uh, be sure to check the links in the description box below for our sponsors and where to find cool stuff from companies that help us out along the way, giving you discount codes uh, with our coupon code down there. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. We'll catch you on the next video.